Hi Scorpio, welcome to Aphrodite Men and Neil Tarot. Um, I'd like to thank everybody who has liked, shared and subscribed to this channel. It's very much appreciated. Please only take what resonates and leave the rest. Please don't make the story fit if it's not yours. Um, I just want to also say that I, I don't do any private readings, so please don't ask for one. Um, there's nothing in my description box for you to be able to do that anyway, so... Um, okay, Scorpio. Let's see what we got for you, Scorpio. out first. I'm going to say we have enough cards here. Wow, Scorpio. Move these up a little bit so you can see them. Scorpio, I do believe that this is probably for a singles reading, but we'll see as we go along. Okay, what we have here is a single person. What I feel for you, Scorpio, is that. Um, you know, in your past position, Scorpio, I feel that um, you've had a, a lot of um, ups and downs in your past where you've had to learn to adapt in certain situations and certain lifestyles and certain ways according to your finances and, um, you know, lived a life that is not really authentic to your true self. I feel that you know in relationships that people have come forward and you've been disappointed um, in those areas and you've um, you've actually chosen to remain single because of that but that's not truly who you are um, Scorpio you are a person that enjoys being in a stable relationship you are a person that does prefer marriage to um, you know just living with somebody but um, I think because you've had failed relationships and meeting the wrong people that um, for, for a while that you just didn't feel that you were good enough for anybody so instead of getting hurt all over again you you choose to remain single now Scorpio I got some news for you you're not going to be single for long um but we'll get to that in a minute, Scorpio. So I do feel that you have uh, been feeling stuck for a long time and you do want some forward movement. And I do feel there's an opportunity for you that's going to open some doors for you that is going to allow you to be your authentic self. So when I say your authentic self is that it's going to allow you to um, dress the way that you you know you would like to dress um, buy the things that you would like to buy and not think twice about how much you are spending um, and I do feel that this opportunity is coming your way very very soon okay um, I do feel that you need to let go of your past you've had 
people that have come into your life, relationships that have juggled you and other people and maybe you feel that you're still in that sort of position now where you are being juggled and, um, you know, just when you think that things are going to move forward that they just go in the opposite direction. But you know what, Scorpio, maybe those people are not meant to be in your life, okay? I do see, Scorpio, that you are very spiritual. And I think that, you know, it, it is time for you to actually go in, onto your journey now. I think the door the doors are going to open to allow you to, um, you know, go more into your spirituality, become more of the Scorpio that you are, okay? Because um, for a long time you just haven't been able to do that. But the gifts that you have, Scorpio, are amazing. And, you know, if you really tap into um, your higher power, you, you will actually see um, that your intuition is, is, you know, very high. And, um, you know, you've been keeping it at a low pace for a long time, but now you're going to have the opportunity to really open that up, okay? Now, I do feel there is somebody in your life at the moment, Scorpio, that you just don't know whether you're Arthur or Martha with this person, okay? Um, you know, I think this person wears a false mask about how they truly feel about you, but I do feel that they are stuck in a situation that they can't get out of. And I do feel, Scorpio, that maybe, you know, you don't want to feel stuck anymore in this situation because you are looking now, Scorpio. You are ready to open things up and you are ready to allow people into your life, okay? I think you were hoping that um, this person would, would come forward and, um, you know, be the man or the woman that you want them to be, um, Scorpio. But I do feel right now your directions... You know, this is actually a bit confusing because you both seem to be on the same direction but doing it separately. But I can tell you that sometime in the future that I feel that this person will be coming back towards you, Scorpio, and um, they want to hope that it's not too late, okay? Because you have the marriage card here. Scorpio, I do feel that your abundance is going to grow and um, there is prosperity coming your way very soon, okay? Uh, there is a victory in a situation that's going to help you to, um, you know, become the person that you truly are, Scorpio, and um, maybe you might even decide to open your own business or, um, you know, but your finances are definitely going to be balancing out. And I do feel that you will be standing in your power, okay? Now, I feel that there is a bit of deception around you, Scorpio. Um, you know, but there is somebody that's coming into your life that is offering you marriage. And I feel that you feel it. I feel that this person, um, you know, is going to make you an offer. I don't know if the person you're dealing with right now, but I do feel that there is somebody coming. The universe is sending this person because I feel that they don't want you to be tied and bound to this situation anymore, Scorpio. You need to move forward, okay? You need to take a direction. Um, you might be waiting on this person to come back Maybe it's a third party situation because I have the marriage card and I have the, you know, the three of cups here. Okay, so it's three people that are involved in this situation. All right. Um, do you feel that this person has you on their mind? They actually don't know what to do, Scorpio. So be, be a little bit gentle towards this person. Um, you know, as much as, you know, things are going to move forward for you, um, and, you know, you just want things to just happen, 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 because that's, that's who you are. When you're ready, you just go, you go for it, okay? Um, but when you know that you can't, you, you do withdraw, but there's a situation coming where you're just going to go, 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 and this person cannot move as quick as you, Scorpio, okay? 
So, you know, you do have a choice, Scorpio, but I do believe that um, you have been hurt by this person um, because, um, yeah, they've, they've chosen a different direction, Scorpio, okay? But they see you as the Empress, somebody who's beautiful and giving and caring and has a lot to offer, you know. And very, very soon you're going to have a lot to offer, Scorpio. So um, I do feel that you're, um, you know, now that the full moon has, has come, um, this is now Scorpio going into a new cycle, okay, a cycle that is full of abundance, a cycle that is going to give you stability. It is going to give you a relationship. Uh, I'm not even going to be surprised if some Scorpio is going to be like in a relationship soon married by the end of the year. Because this person that is coming into your life, they, they don't want to let you go. They they have found what they are looking for and, and everything that they are looking for is within you, Scorpio. So um, good luck to those that, that are going to gonna have this you know because this this is a a good person now i feel that the person that you're in a third party with uh struggling a little bit financially and don't want to show you that um they've had a lot of um things that they've had to pay out but there's not a lot of work coming in so it's a, they feel a little bit embarrassed but scorpio you know what you have been there and, you know, there's nothing embarrassing about it. And, um, you know, you, you would help this person if they spoke up. But at the same time, they're not going to Scorpio. They're too proud. And, um, you know, I think that's why they're choosing to stay in the, in the relationship that they're in. Um, because at least they have a roof over their head to, um, they know where they stand in that situation, okay? But I'm not going to say they're happy, Scorpio, because I don't feel that this person is happy at all, okay? All right, let's move on. Let's see where this is going, Scorpio. Scorpio, I do feel that you are going to be turning your back on situations that, um, you know, they, ha they have hurt you, Scorpio, and um, I don't feel that you want to go through any more hurt, Scorpio. You 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 are now seeing things clearly for what they are, okay? Now, there is a relationship coming in for you. I don't know, Scorpio. I, I'm feeling that... that this person, the one that's married, is um, is in time going to leave this relationship because there's too, many, too much quarrels going on. They can't seem to come to some sort of agreement, this man and their partner, okay? And I do feel that this person feels that you, you possibly might be um, their twin flame or, or their soulmate or a soulmate twin flame. Okay, combination, you know, and um, that kind of combination is, um, you know, although two people cannot uh, always agree on on the same things, somehow uh, there's other things that will keep them together. Maybe they have great passion together. Maybe there's there's a very strong bond and a very strong love that keep keeps these people together, and I think that's how this person feels about you. Okay. And um, there is going to be arguments in, in the relationship that this person has, all right? And um, you are very much in, in their thoughts, Scorpio. And um, they are struggling whether they should turn their backs and come towards you. Scorpio, I feel that this person will remain um, in contact with you in the future. I think you feel right now that this person has a bit of sneaky behaviour going on, maybe holding back some secrets from you, um, and is probably putting you in a confusing state. And this is a state that you don't want to be in anymore, Scorpio. 
you need to remain balanced. You need to, um, you know, not go through any mental anguish. And I think that you have, um, Scorpio, withdrawn your energy um, so you don't end up in this situation, okay? You are allowing this person the freedom to do whatever they want to do, okay? And I feel that you're going to be doing whatever you want to do now, Scorpio, too, okay? Um, you know, I feel that um, the world has opened up a leap of faith for you. Success is yours, Scorpio. You will be climbing the ladder of success, okay? Um, you know, this is going to bring changes within your home. This is going to give you, um, you know, uh, a lot of... Um, um, a lot of paths that you can now take and a lot of changes that you can make, okay? Um, this person that is juggling has a tower moment coming in. This person has a battle that they continuously have to go through and they're trying to, um, you know, control the urge to come towards you, Scorpio. They are trying to create distance between you and, and them, okay? Male or female, doesn't matter, just take it as it resonates okay um you know i do feel that that they struggle um to not come towards you scorpio all right but um yeah scorpio this person is at a crossroad this person is trying to find their strength they are becoming a little bit not silent, I'm not going to say they're silent, but they're, they're, they're on pause. They're on pause. I think they want to rebuild their finances, Scorpio. Um, but still, like I said, the communication is still there. Okay. Um, I feel this person, Scorpio, um, is somebody from your past that had choices. And I think they feel that they made the wrong choice now. Let's look a little bit more. Yeah. They're in their head thinking, you know, did I make the right choice? Did I make the right wrong choice? And um, I think they they um, they saw their success with somebody else and thought that they had their justice, okay? And, and now they're at a crossroad. I don't know how this reading has turned out to be about this person, but I see, Scorpio, that you will um, move on and, and just take your pain and just go you know you want to go to calmer waters you want to get away you want to just disappear for a little while and i think you will scorpio because i see you going within now scorpio you have the star under the justice card justice will be in your favor so for those of you that are going through some sort of legal issue or waiting on a, on a decision to be made um it is showing that it will be in your favor, Scorpio, you know, and this is going to help you move on and put an end to your past and to start new beginnings. And God bless you, Scorpio. I really, you know, hope this works out for you um, because you have gone through a lot and, you know, um, you, you can now, after, after this, be your authentic self, Scorpio. So, you know what? Throw your wardrobe out. It's all going to be new, 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 okay? Yeah, Scorpio, look, you got finances coming in. Please hang on to some of them, you know, some of your finances and be very careful in, in what you do because, you know, the victory is going to be yours. I do see, Scorpio, that you will be traveling. Maybe you're going to um, leave um, where you're living now and just go somewhere else far away and just restart your life again, okay? I do feel, Scorpio, that um, you have already been looking and searching um, and trying to decide which direction you want to go. Um, I do feel that you have a plan that you want to implement, okay? Because you're coming in as the King of Cups, uh, King of Pentacles, Scorpio, which, um, you know, this is a, a person that um, runs their own kingdom and has enough finances to do what they want to do, okay? 
So, um, Scorpio, you are looking to, to possibly uh, move. I don't think you've been revealing too much of what you want to do, but wherever you're going, Scorpio, there is a, a happy home. There is a happy home. So maybe you're going um, to move and purchase yourself a property. And once you purchase that property, that's where you're going to find this this love that's going to come in. Um, but I also feel you're going to fall in love with this property, okay? But I feel that once, once you do that, once this abundance comes through, the justice goes in your favor, um, you will have a victory. Um, I think you will be thinking long and hard about um, what you can do, you know. I feel that you will help your family and then you will you will move somewhere else, okay? And wherever you go, Scorpio, wherever you decide to spend the rest of your life, there is going to be a happy home and there is going to be love that's going to come in for you, Scorpio. So yes, Scorpio, you will be rebuilding elsewhere, okay? I do feel that there is a person that is coming into your life. Um, I do feel that it may be a fire sign, possibly a Sagittarius or, or a Leo. Um, maybe it's two people that are going to come forward, okay, and fight for your attention. I think you need to decide, Scorpio, which one is it going to be? Which one are you going to make, accept the offer, okay? Um, well, Scorpio, <laughs> you started off as somebody single that is going to be possibly married, okay, um, very soon. So I do feel that, you know, you are on the right path. I do feel that you are going in the right direction. Wherever you're going to go is going to be good for you, um, not only for your peace of mind, but also for your health. And I do feel that once you get there, and you settle down and you, um, you know, once you settle down that you will have not one but two offers coming in, okay? Both fighting for your attention and you don't know who to give your cup of love to. So I feel that one may be somebody from your past and the other one is somebody new. Okay, so Scorpio... Decisions. All right, Scorpio. Let's see what these cards have to say. I'll do three more shuffles, and if nothing falls out, I'll choose them myself. Let us see. Ah, uh, Scorpio, you have the card of possibility. You have the card of anger. You loved. Dance. Let's take the bottom. Sanctuary. And let's take the top goddess okay Scorpio you got some good cards um, Scorpio I think you need to um, release your anger Scorpio um, you need to safely express okay I feel, I feel that maybe there's going to be communication between you and this person from the past okay I do feel between you and this person you are both feeling some sort of anger because one is stuck in a position and you um, were hoping that maybe uh, that things were going to move forward and um, this kind of like has put you in a position where, um, you know, of all people that did this to you, it had to be this one, okay? But you have love for this person. That's why, um, you know, you're... Um, you're going to say exactly how you feel, but you're going to do it um, in a controlling way, okay? Um, you're just going to get your message across to this person, all right? I do feel that you and this person had possibilities, 
okay um but you know the chance was not taken and this this is what really angers you because um you you knew you knew scorpio your intuition had always known all right so scorpio look i do feel you are gonna get away scorpio um you're gonna go find somewhere quiet somewhere where you can you know cut yourself out from the world and spend more time alone and while you're there scorpio i think you're going to tap into your intuition you're going to do some meditation you're going to um you know raise your your vibration scorpio okay because you are coming in as the goddess scorpio okay the card says honor your divine feminine energy see your inner beauty and love every part of you and i think scorpio you need to you know be proud of your achievements and um you know honor your body don't don't worry about whether you, you know you're overweight you're underweight or, or whatever you know be be proud of yourself okay um because you deserve to be happy scorpio and i do find that you know you'll be dancing you'll be dancing soon happiness is just around the corner for you and i think you feel it you know so you go ahead and dance to, to the music, turn it up and, and be yourself, Scorpio. But, you know, once you, you have done this, Scorpio, you have the card of Beloved, okay? Prepare for your life partner. Romance is returning to your relationship. Believe you are lovable. And yes, Scorpio, please believe that you are lovable. You've had a lot of um, people that, you know, made you feel that you, you weren't. Um, you know, and you, you went from this, I don't know, you, you went from this person of who was always taking pride in themselves and always dressed well and looked good to, to somebody who sits around in, in gym wear or, or track suits all day. And you, and you know, Scorpio, you know who you are and you are going to have the opportunity to go back and be the person that, you know that you are you're going to turn heads Scorpio honestly you know so be prepared because I do believe that there is somebody well probably two people coming back and you're going to have to make a decision but um you know romance is returning to your relationship so you are lovable Scorpio and I'm very proud of you and I wish you all the best and good luck for your future and um you know, let me know if this resonates with anybody because, you know, you are a very blessed person right now. So good luck and take care and uh, all the best. Bye.